Where are we going, guys? Go karting. Go Oh. <laughs> so these go karts are no joke. We've been and there. I'm the best go kart driver. Barely. Um, we've been there before. We loved it. It's almost in Belgrade, but not quite. Go Who's gonna win? Me, me, Xavier. Of course. Me, Dad. Me Show me Dad. what you do, Xavier, on the turns. You gotta, so, you gotta lighten yourself up a little bit sometimes. It depends where you are, you just... And, because the cart is already bouncing, so you might as well bounce with it. And how do you do the turns? You gotta... You gotta <laughs> go, go with the turn, you can't lean out of it. So guys, last time I went, my arms hurt so bad, I couldn't even like feed myself. And Leia had to feed me, right Leia? I remember? <laughs> and I was like, trying to like... <laughs> so I'm really hoping the same thing doesn't happen. And you're probably thinking like, why would her arms hurt like that? There is no power steering fluid. This is manual turning. This is 10 minutes of intensity and I need to win. We are a competitive family. Yeah, you think you're gonna. And uh, my weight goes against me, being that this kid is a twig. He's skinnier than skinny. And I train this. Uh, we train this every day, scooter training. So, all I can do is use technique and hope for the best. Mickey, do you think you're winning? I know I'm coming last. I watch go karting videos. Okay, so I wish, I wish I could record because he's definitely not there for fun. Let me tell you how competitive this guy is. Last time we went, he was like trying to cut me off and like put me into the shoulder. And he's yelling things. He gets quite aggressive on there. So unfortunately I can't record when we're on there. I don't have a GoPro and if I did. Oh, I should have brought my GoPro. Where are you gonna attach it, bro? Inside the house. Anyways, I'm gonna take you there. the last time we went to the go-karting track is because they said to us take your first two laps slowly get a feel for the track and then go fast so being the adult and the responsible person <laughs> I am I'm like okay Xavier hops in pedal to the metal starts whipping around and so he got an advantage too. that advantage is not happening because I do not need one to two laps around to get a feel for the track. This time, I know the track. Yeah, but you're gonna try and race on gold tires and you're gonna spin out, so I don't really, I didn't, 
you don't know how to wait. There's oh just God. this one turn, this really, really sharp one turn that I always like mess up on. It's, I'm just hoping I don't. It's just a you. Yeah, it's I can't. Not that big of a that's deal. pretty sharp. I only mess up at the you edge. You sure you're not gonna crash into anybody today? Oh, I'll purposely crash into Xavier. No, you won't. It gets me ahead of him. Think smarter, not harder. And also, why is it 23 degrees here and people are still wearing like jackets with fur on them and like heavy wool jackets and down filled vests? It's very confusing. That's just Xavier making Xavier noises. Yeah, he's always dramatic. You think I'm dramatic? I'm not dramatic. Once we go off camera, I'll tell a big deal. Bombastic side eye. Okay, shut it off. I need to say something. <laughs> Okay, it's off. It's off. <laughs> well, actually, turn it off. Here it is, guys. There's the track. Here's the champ. Oh, the camera's oh. facing the wrong way. <laughs> that's where. Uh, oh, here's the champ. Sorry about that's that. Where the paintballing is. Sorry look. about that. Yeah, look. It's Vini. Look. It's Vini today. You can see all the tires. I'm going to show you my ballerina sister in law. Here's the losers. Here's all the losers here. They're about to lose. Everybody. It's an hour and a half wait, but what are you going to do? It's a nice day, and we came here to do this. So, change of plans. Um, anyone coming to go go karting, your child has to be 135 centimeters, which is totally okay for like my family, immediate family, but unfortunately, my niece and nephew are not that tall. So, to be fair, we're going to stick together, we're going to go somewhere else, and I will remain the winner in my thoughts. So yeah, unfortunately, my nephew and my niece are very sad, and they didn't answer the phone here, and we called, I think, nine times. So, it is kind of frustrating to know that we called so many times, and then we, you know, could have had more information. Um, being that we've been here before, we weren't concerned about any of those details, but again, Answer the phone next time, guys. Okay, due to the height issue of my niece and nephew, we are now going bowling, and I'm still going to be the champ. It's so hard to not be the champ. Am I going to win? Oh, yeah. The best of bowling. <laughs> She's my biggest fan. Thank God. Kiki, am I going to win in bowling? I'm your biggest fan. Am I going to win in bowling? Yeah. My family's so great. You're the Xavier's, bestest. Watch this though. Xavier, is mom going to win in bowling? You're lying. You just said you're going to win. Who's going to win in bowling, Leah? Me. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Who's going to lose? Who's that? Oh, my poor sister-in-law. You hear that? She needs some confidence boosting skills, guys. You gotta walk in and feel like no, a champ I'm to be a champ. Oh man. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately. Ciao. And this is where Leia used to play her soccer. Not anymore. Yeah, it sounds busy down there. Oh boy. No, where is it? Yeah. Well, we can go get the waffle in the meantime. How busy is it? Oh, jeez, Louise is busy. I am so over today. Now we can't go bowling because there's a birthday party and they're fully booked. We're 
when everything fails, go get gelato. And that's, that's, that's what's gonna happen now because I'm over this. I am done. Now, my poor nephew is bawling his eyes out, being consoled by his cousin. His kids don't understand the same way that older children understand and adults. Right now, we're trying to figure this out. Oh, come on, sweetie. Great news, guys. Only one hour wait. The guy downstairs didn't know what he was talking about. TIS, this is Serbia. That is my saying. Like, when things start to go haywire and I'm like, why is this happening? I'm like, TIS, this is Serbia. So, we're going to go to gelato, get gelato. And then we're going to come back when it's our reservation time. See you soon. What? And Daddy put him in the grass. Yeah, cool. where what? Nobody can find him. An injured honeybee. That's not a honeybee. Yes, yes it, is. it is. Aww. Injured honeybee. So how many lanes did you guys book? He booked it. I don't know. Doesn't she look ridiculous dancing in public, guys? He's got a beard, this dog. This is our gelato spot. Look, the doggies in line. Look at the cotton candy. I'd rather get cotton candy than do bowling. Look at the cotton candy. We are finally going to do something. We are actually going to bowl. We are here and we are excited. We came through for the little ones. I used to bowl competitively. You wouldn't know it by the way I bowl today. I bowled like poop. But we don't talk about Bruno, so that's over. We don't talk about Bruno, no, no, no. I won bowling. You did really good. Auntie was like, oh my god, he's just like his auntie. You did really You did no 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 sweetie. You did really good too. You killed it. I got two strikes and a lot of spares. 
Yeah. Xavier, how'd you ball? I beat mom. You in your feelings now, bro? No. You look like it. Other reasons? Girl problems? You got 99 problems, but it ain't one. Hit me.